Hello and welcome. Today, I am going to really fix something that has been weighing on my mind consistently for the past few months. That, combined with the fact that I've now decided that I am a painter, I have come up with the most wonderful video to do today. I'm going to fix, well not fix, because it's a good, it's a good painting, I like it, I just need it to match my vibes. I'm going to repaint an IKEA painting that has been in my room for literally probably five or six years. I couldn't figure out what was, what, what was off about it, I think I figured it out. My room is literally, if you can't tell, it's all pink. It's my little pink cube of happiness and good vibes and said Ikea painting. I haven't even hung it up in the six years that I've had it because something's always been off and I figured out what it is. It's so pretty, but it's like the white, like the canvas, I just do not like the color. So I have some kind of inspiration on Pinterest and we have established that I love Pinterest. I have a painting that was the original idea for what I was gonna do and then I realized how big this was about a few minutes ago and now I don't think I can do the whole thing like this, but that's okay because I can figure something else out. So this painting is like so beautiful, but I love this painting, it's so wonderful. It's really good, I just love the colors, I love everything about it. Um, I'm obsessed with it, and I think that I need those vibes in um, this painting. Should I do like a test? I'm gonna do a test blob to see how well it adheres to the surface. Um, but today I'm using some, I bought some new paints, and so I'm really excited. They're in a nice little box, but this is my favorite brand of paints I've discovered and I bought the Muted Collection and the Classics pack basically but I really like the Muted stuff I don't know if I'll use that today though so I'm just gonna take a little bit of this and see if it sticks well where should I put it? On the side? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna let that dry and I'm gonna see what happens. I've been trying this for hours, okay? Okay, I made some TikToks while I was waiting for it to dry and it looks like it dried well. So, I think I just need to focus on just like the bulk of it and I'm gonna use this brush for now and then we're gonna go in and we're gonna add some things and hope it looks good so I'm going to make a light pink with some white and some pink I'm so bad at making TikToks and that's what I spent the time doing and it honestly just drained me I look kind of good though so it was like okay except I can't figure out how to do the M to the B thing so that was frustrating. I literally did that for like an hour. I love that. Okay, this is perfect. Yeah, <laughs> I love this. Oh. I'm literally Bob Ross. Okay, I'm gonna need quite a bit more though. Like, and I kinda don't care if it's like sloppy. I just kinda want it. Okay, honestly, it looks pretty bomb. Ooh, 
lovely. I do need a lot more though. I mean, honestly, so far, so good. I kind of just want to make like an outline here and sort of, and I'll go in. I haven't finished a sentence. I'll go in with like other colors. This actually kind of looks cool. I kind of dig it. It's kind of fun. That kind of looks awesome. I kind of think that, that was a great idea. Okay. So that was really fun. Now I want to go in with like a different color around like the edges or something. The color I made is this like dusty rose color. You can't see that. And I'm gonna go around in the edges and just like fill in like her skin and like the edges of this. This kind of is looking really nice. Look at her. She's pink. We love to see it. There's a lot of texture on the canvas. I just have this section left. I'm like literally almost out of paint. Oh. But the plan is that I'm gonna let this dry a little bit and then I'm gonna go in with like either, probably like a purple slash like a light blue and I'm gonna go in and um, go over some of the black. I'm gonna leave some of the black, um, I think. But right now, we're just almost done with the pink. Okay, I've done it. Now I'm just gonna go through and I see some like places where I missed in the pink part and I'm just gonna go in and add some little brush strokes there. All right, for now I'm satisfied. And I'm gonna go in with, um, I think right now just like a dark purple keeping to the original shape. is not super necessary for me. I just want to Interesting.
now I'm mixing a blue and I'm gonna mix white. I'm gonna make like a light blue. And I'm really just using a full tube of white. Crazy. Full tube of white gone in this project. This is it right now. And I think I'm gonna let it dry and then tomorrow I'm gonna add some more pink. Yay! This is the final product. Yay! She's interesting. Look at the hair. You thought it was gonna be ugly, right? I know I did. But it's kind of a moment. I might go in and add some more pink if I'm being honest. But for now, I feel like this is going to be one of those projects where I don't touch it for a few months and that's going to be okay because she looks so cool. Yeah, I actually, I'm not feeling the purple. It looks way better. The purple looks way better in person, actually. But this is the final product. <laughs> Yay!